When I went to the doctor for an, another problem, they took x-rays and found out that I had kidney cancer. I was referred to Dr. Bischoff at Intermountain Medical Center. Well, Mrs. Green came to me and she had actually been turned away from several other institutions because of the complex nature of the tumor in her kidney. She had a tumor in the kidney that was right in the middle, which is where all the arteries and the veins come into that kidney. Can be a difficult surgery, and because of her other medical conditions, some of the other institutions in our area weren't very excited about trying to preserve the kidney. They thought that she should probably just have the kidney removed. When I went to see him, he said, you know, Linda, you got some other problems. I'm gonna try and save your kidney. Well, I was kind of shocked because I hadn't been told that there was even a chance of saving my kidney because the operation was too complicated. Our cancer services have a very broad-based successful program built on evidence-based treatment for our patients. And recently, the Transformation Lab here at Intermountain Healthcare approached me about the possibility of actually printing a patient's organ that would be used in preparation for surgery, also used to teach a patient and their family about the particular disease process that we have. We did a three-dimensional reconstruction on the CAT scan computer of her kidney. And then this was sent back to the transformation lab who had the kidney printed using a 3D format printer. One thing I love about Intermountain Medical Center is that they keep up on the advancements in technology. And because they do, the 3D imaging really helped me. It's like we took her kidney out to have a chance to explore it, look at it, before we operated on it. This is exactly her anatomy from the 3D constructed image. And because of the model and referring back and forth to it, we were able to, number one, dissect the tumor out of this area of the kidney without causing any significant bleeding. We were also able to completely identify the tip of the tumor, which we very easily could have missed without the model. And we cured her of her cancer that day. We were able to do it laparoscopically, and Mrs. Green went home the next day cancer-free and with her entire kidney intact. Everything we do is patient-centered really looking at how we bring these technologies or improve how our caregivers work to ultimately help people live the healthiest lives possible. I want other people to know that there is hope. With the right technology, a lot better things can happen for each of us. And that's what he did. He saved it.